Hello and welcome to step two of the step-by-step -step guide. In this video, we will be looking at creating the application that will be tested, also known as System Under Test. The application will be a simple calculator in a C-sharp class library. Okay, first up, open up Microsoft Visual Studio and click on Create a New Project. Now we will be able to pick the project template we like to use. Search for Class Library Core and select the C-Sharp Class Library .NET Core project template and click Next. Here you will be asked to pick a project name and choose the location to save the project to. I will be saving to a folder called Work in the C drive. The solution name will automatically update. Leave it as it is. We will pick SpecFlow Calculator for the project name here. Click Create. A blank project template we then open up in Visual Studio. Now go to the Solution Explorer window, right click on class.cs and rename it to calculator.cs. Hit yes on the pop-up window. Next, you want to replace the existing code here with the one we're providing. You can find this on our step-by-step -step web page Once you paste in the new code, you want to build the solution. You can do this by navigating to build and then build solution. This should take only a few seconds and you should see the build one succeeded message in the output window at the bottom. The calculator application is now built. In the next step, you will learn how to create a SpecFlow project. Once again, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.